During football season, tailgating is not just about a grill and a cooler of beer. For some, it's a lifestyle, especially here in the South. And joining us with several great tailgating ideas from Evan and Company event planner, Evan Cooper. Evan, thank you for joining us. This looks great. Thank you so much. I don't know a lot about football, but I do know how to throw a great party. You know how to and throw so a party. so that's what we're going to talk about today. <laughs> and you really say it comes down to three things. Yeah, three, three things that everybody has. Um, the first thing being using some things that you already have laying around your house to help kind of elevate your table decor and your experience. So um, we have here on the table, you can see we've used some cutting boards to display our wings. We've used some baskets maybe from the coffee table, some cake stands. So there's lots of different things that you can have already probably laying around your house that you can use just to help elevate your experience. Yeah, I always have these shakers after the game and I probably have yes. 100 around my house. I'm like, why do I keep these? But yes. yeah, you the can use it. The shakers are great. That's that's our third That's our third thing is, is shakers, collegiate, you know, hand towels, napkins, all the things that you've probably collected over the years. Stadium cups always adds a little flair to your to your game day decor. Yeah, those souvenir cups that you collect and you go, what am I going to do with these? Of them. You know, stacks and stacks of them. Stacks I leave every them. game with stacks yes. of cups and they will come in handy later. The food, the that food, may be the most important that's part. That's the most important part. So you can see here we have quite the spread of some tailgate food, some of our favorite wings with celery and, and some carrots. You know, you can't have wings without the celery. Some chips and dip and some cookies, some cheese biscuits, all the fun things that you need at a tailgate party. You can decorate these with your team colors, your favorite team, you want you want that to be part of the decor as well. Yes, that's that's an element that you can do with your kiddos at home or like me, you can just stop by the local bakery and <laughs> pick them up, um, you know, so. I like make it easy, make it simple because <laughs> exactly. you're gonna, it's a lot to unpack and, and get everything set up if you're going to go tailgate on campus. So you can make it as simple as possible. I mean, even the chicken wings, you can have somebody else make yeah. that for you. Pick that up from the grocery store, the cookies, all things to make it easier for you, for sure. And you have that signature drink. That Tell us signature what this drink. Is. I know you're an Auburn fan, yes, just like Eagle. myself. <laughs> and so we took just the traditional Arnold Palmer, which is sweet tea and lemonade, put a little bit of spin on it, just by adding a shot of your favorite bourbon or whiskey in it, and it makes for the perfect game day cocktail. Yeah, and if you want to make it kid friendly, then you don't have to put the the alcohol in there. For sure. And of course, you want this to be Tumor's lemonade, right? Well, exactly, <laughs> Tumor's lemonade, some Milo sweet tea, your favorite bourbon, and you are good to go. For folks who say, Evan, I am not creative like you. I cannot do this. What's your advice to them? You know, there's tons of things online with Pinterest and Instagram. Take some things, look at different photos and kind of make it your own at your house. Or, you know, if you want to call me, I would be more than happy to help you out. <laughs> How can folks get in touch with you, Evan? They can follow me on Instagram, Evan G. Cooper, or they can shoot me an email, Evan at EvanandCompany.com. I love even your bowls. You can get into the decor. Just even if you don't have football themed yeah, for sure. You can, you can use just colors. Colors, exactly. You're, you see here we have an orange bowl with our salsa here. Just think adding in some more of that, that team spirit with our flowers. You see we've used some color there as well. So it's about using your imagination and creativity and making it your own. And just get creative. You know, if it, if it doesn't work, you try, but you're not going to learn unless. Keep trying. You Keep give, trying. <laughs> you give it a try. That's right. Would you say, you know, make a list, kind of, you know, write down what you need, what all you want, and simplify it that way. Simplify it, yes. It's it's about taking and, and you know, knowing your space. If you're going to set up on your dining room table, you know, kind of practice the night before with your platters and your trays and pull things from around your house. And that day, you know, you're you're ready to go. It's as easy as that. And like you said, there are so many outlets these days online where you can get ideas and get inspiration. For sure, yeah. Pinterest, Instagram is great. Um, you know, as simple as a Google search, tailgate party decor ideas. You know, it's, it's all at our fingertips. You can usually find a ton of stuff around your house to make it work. Let's get some chicken. Let's get some chicken. <laughs> We go. This looks good. Cheers. 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 War Eagle. <laughs> War Eagle. This looks delicious. Thank you, Thank Evan. you so Thank you. much. Everything you do, it always looks beautiful, and I mind those cookies uh, you can have as them. well. Yeah. <laughs> Still to come, what you need to know about a farm swap happening tomorrow in Prattville. Stay with us. We'll be right back.